given the function y equals x raised to the sine of x squared, let's calculate its derivative. We see that we have a function raised to another function. So, to calculate this derivative, we have to apply logarithms to both parts of the equal. So, the natural logarithm of y equals the natural logarithm of x raised to the sine of x squared. Using the properties of logarithms, in the logarithm of a power, the exponent goes in front. This is the natural logarithm of y equals the sine of x squared times the logarithm of x. Derivating everything, we have the, the derivative of the logarithm of y is the derivative of y divided by y equal the derivative of a product, that's the derivative of the first element times the second one plus the first times the derivative of the second. This would be the derivative of sine of x square is 2x times the cosine of x square times the logarithm of x plus sine of x square times 1 divided by x. The derivative of the logarithm of x. This is the same as the sine of x square divided by x. And we would have the, der the derivative of y divided by y is equal to 2x times the cosine of x square times the logarithm of x plus the sine of x square divided by x. The y that is on the denominator goes to the other part multiplying. So, the derivative of y would be y times everything we have here, 2x times the cosine of x square times the logarithm of x plus the sine of x square divided by x. To finish, we just have to substitute the expression of y. It would be x raised to the sine of x square times 2x times the cosine of x square times the logarithm of x plus the sine of x square divided by x. This would be the result of the derivative we were asked to solve.